All right, Shalom. I'm going to give all praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah. All right, double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. It's your brother, Yashar Gabar. Back at you with another lesson. You know, in the lesson, you know, today is going to be about, you know, really enduring affliction, man. All right. You know, you know, the time we're living in, you know, the year of prophecies, you know, and them demons, you know, is uh, is is going hard, you know, on brothers, you know. All right. And things starting to speed up, man. But we got to endure that affliction. All right. You know, every, um, not every day, everything's going OK, man. All right. Sometimes you know, you're dealing with different situations every day. All right. Some days things might be going good. And some days you know, things might not just be going good, man. All right. Some days you um everything's going well. You know, and next thing, you know, the next day, um, different situations getting thrown at you, all right? Whether it be um, money problems, dealing with family, all right? Um, whatever the case may be, all right? You know? But you got to endure that affliction, man. All right? I'm going to bring out this first scripture. This is second, second Timothy. Chapter 4, verse 5. It says, But thou in all things endure affliction. Do the work of an evangelist. Make full proof of thy ministry. All right? So the main um, thing, you know, endure the affliction, man. All right? The main thing I wanted to bring out was um, endure the affliction. All right? You know, and enduring just Endure just to me, um, just mean, um, to be made hard, all right. You know, you gotta come at those problems hard, man, all right. You know, when them afflictions coming at you, man, you gotta, um, go at it, man, you know, you gotta deal with those problems, all right, you know. Whether it's demons dealing with you, all right. Whether it's um, you know, you just feeling like woe is me spirit, all right. You know, brothers had that um woe is me spirit. You just feel like everything's just coming at you, all right. You know, but the main key is to endure that man, you know, until the end. All right, it says, do the work and evangelist, making full proof of thy ministry. All right, endure, you know. Whenever it's a problem, all right, whether, whenever it's feeling like um, um, the spirit just on you, all right, just the demons fucking, you, fucking with you, Satan fucking with you, you know, you got to um, do a lesson, all right. Do a do a lesson, all right. Get in the, um get in the scriptures, man, and read. You know, all right. That's the best way, man. All right. Whenever you just feeling, you know. Bring out this next scripture. Just endure the affliction, man. All right, because if you don't endure, all right, that mean you um you soft, man. All right, you being made soft. All right, if you don't endure that affliction, man. All right, you know and it all has come from um from the Lord. All right, whether He testing you, testing your faith. All right, bring out this. Proverbs chapter 2, verse 11. It says, My son, despise not. It's, it's, all right, so like you. This is Proverbs chapter 3, verse 11. It says, My son, despise not the testing of the Lord, neither be wary of his correction. All right, so despise not the testing of the Lord, man. All right. 
That means the, the Lord's dealing with you, man. You know? And you got to show the Lord um, you're going to endure, all right? You got to show the Lord that you're going to um, break through those barriers, man, all right? You got to show the Lord, you know, you're going to put your all and, and keep going, you know, and endure to the end, all right? You know, because it's all the Lord, man, all right? That means the Lord's dealing with you. You know, bring this up. It's First Corinthians, chapter ten, verse thirteen. It says, "There has, there has, had no temptation taken you, but such as, as is common to men." But God is faithful, all right? So the Lord is faithful, man, all right? The Lord ain't going to forget about you, you know? All right? The Lord is always um going to be able to um get you out of that situation, you know? The Lord going to deliver you from the situation, all right? And that's the um the, um, the meaning of the Lord's name, all right? Yahweh Shah, he's delivered. All right, he gonna deliver you out that situation. All right, every sit, every situation. All right, you know, because as the scripture said, the Lord is faithful, man. All right, and it says, "Who will not suffer you to be tempted above that ye are that ye are able?" All right, so the Lord is not gonna put you through something that you ain't gonna um be able to handle, man. All right. All right, different brothers got different lots, all right? Some brothers may may be able to handle some things, and some brothers may not be able to handle certain things, all right? But if you're getting chastised by the Lord, you know, you know, the Lord is not going to put you through something you can't handle, man, all right? That's just the Lord trying you, man. You're getting tried, all right? You know? But you got to, um, the main topic, you know, endure the affliction, man. You know? Because every day, it, um, things ain't going well, all right? Every day, shit ain't going well for it, brother, all right? All right? I ain't want to make this too long. And I'm going to end it with this last scripture. This is um, 1 Thessalonians chapter 4, verse 18. It says, so I can't see it. There it is. It says, wherefore, comfort one another with these words. All right. So the scripture says, comfort one another with the words. All right. Meaning the um these words is comfort, man. All right, read some. Hop in the scriptures and read. All right, if you feeling at your um, at your, if you at your lows, man. All right, the scriptures is comfort. You know, knowing that the Lord is here with you and gonna be um gonna deliver you out of the troubles if you just endure it to the end. All right, that's comfort. You know, seeing that this, um, hearing the scripture said this shit is not going to be forever, man. All right. That America is going to fall. That's comfort, you know, and that the Lord is going to deliver you, del deliver you out of here. All right. You know, what you got to do is just endure until the end. All right. Don't, um, soften up, man. All right. When things getting thrown at you, all right? Because the Lord is not going to give you something you can't handle, man. All right? You know, and with that, I'm um, just enduring to the end, all right? Keep pushing. Keep doing lessons, all right? If you're feeling that you're low, you're in the scriptures, read, do lessons, all right? Comfort yourself. Comfort another brother, you know? 
comfort one another, man, with these words. All right. So with that, I'm going to end it off with that. I'm going to give all praises to Yahweh, Ba'asim, Yahweh Shai, Ba'asim, Rekach, All right, that belongs to my elders and apostles of Great Millstone that taught me this truth. All right, so I'm on.